Welcome to the Folklorama at Home, the virtual experience presented by the Manitoba government's Safe at Home program. My name is Tanya and I'll be your tour guide as we explore cultures from around the world, including some in our own backyard. If you would like to chat with us today, feel free to chat with us at the chat bar, either to the side or below, depending on your device. Otherwise, grab your passport, sit back and relax, and let's explore Latin America and the colors with our friend Jorge. Hello, Jorge. How are you? Hello. How are you? Good. How are you? Pretty good. Pretty good. Thank you for inviting me on this beautiful event. Thank you so much for coming today. How did you become an artist? Oh, well, was, when I was a little kid, I had enthusiastic in sculpture and drawings, painting. Did you go to school for this type of thing? Yes, yes. Okay. I was inside the, my country and outside as well. And what country had, are you from? I am from El Salvador, Central America. Oh, I am beautiful. very proud, and now my home is Canada. Now, how did I, we go from El Salvador to Canada? Oh, we had, uh, you know, some problems there. Okay. Yeah, we came here with my family, oh, and Canada opened the door for us. I am very happy. Oh, good to hear. Yeah. Now, since you've been in Canada, you do workshops. Oh, yes. Tell me about uh, the different workshops you do. Oh, what beautiful experience because I'm working with the organization, woman organization. Okay. I give you so, some workshop in watercolor, acrylic, and as well in Arbit, uh, some person, they have uh, some problems. Okay. In Emigrant Center as well. Okay. I give you, but everything is free. Okay, it's beautiful. Uh, all, all my workshop or organization, no profit, I, I give you free. Now, it must be really helping a lot of people. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yes. So, really so, some people, they have problems with the, the edge. And my artwork and stone and, and wood, they, they, it's, it's important because I have family. I love my family and everybody is my family. Yeah. That's it, the, the reason I made that the new series that right. I call family. Oh, that's wonderful. So when you do all this fantastic artwork, what does that mean to you? Like, how do you feel uh, when you do it? I am in basic and three F stay, okay. sociologic, philosophic, and psychologic. Okay. That one is my statement in, in all my artwork. I try to investigate the, the different medium as well. One part is m more philosophic and the other part is more technique. I like to investigate different techniques, different oh, expression, and in chair as well. Okay. Now, when you do all these different techniques, when you sit down to do your artwork, do you sit down and say, today I'm going to sketch this? Or, uh, or you just feel it? I, I working in series. For example, okay. right now I working in the family. Okay. But the family for me, uh, no mean traditional, you are my family. Aww. Everybody my family I had to love. Yeah. And share, I care about, about you, That's everything. Beautiful. I think I love my family, I love you, everybody, I love you. We're, we're so glad yeah, to be, we're uh, so glad uh, to be uh, part uh, of your family. How long have you been a part of the Folklorama family? Oh, almost 30, 34 years. Really? Yeah, and Christian Hidalgo invited me the first time, and his good friend. Yeah. And, and the personal and art, he respect my art. He understand the process of my artwork. Yes. I, I, I am very proud. He and Charmy decorate some painting for him and his sculpture as well. Oh. I am very proud. That's wonderful yeah. to hear. Now, I know we're going to take a second and you're going to walk through all the different beautiful art pieces that you do. Yeah. Great. Oh, Jorge, a lot of artists I know usually do one medium. You do four or probably way more. More. Probably, yeah. Yes. Wow. So explain, now this looks like wood? Yeah, this is wood. Okay. D different kind. Hawk, walnut, but in this oh. case, this one is basswood, this one is pine. Oh, really? Yes. So how do you, do you just choose the piece of wood and like actually carve it? Yes, I carving, I have uh, gouges, different tools. Wow. It's, I mean, they a special tool, but you can do it with knife okay. or anything. The important thing is I never repeat my work. Oh. Uh, I work in direct. Okay. 
I pick it up a stone or wood, I work in like that. And, and is it, do you know what you're going to do when you start the project or will you just see it and you're like, this is yes, what I feel? Yes, yeah, no, the material called my soul and they are together, they dancing, it's romantic. Little salsa, yeah, little merengue, I love uh, that. I yeah. don't know exactly <laughs> what, sometimes. Yeah. Some, 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 yes. Do you choose certain woods? Like, do you prefer certain woods to carve than others? Uh, no, exactly. Okay. It's what I, we can find. For example, walnut, uh, sometimes it's very expensive. You can find almost it's wood or pine. Okay. It's more and more. But I have in walnut, I have in oak. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's wonderful. Now, this is stone? Yeah, that one is a stone. How do this you one carve is stone? Al alabaster. And this one is uh, soft stone. This one is alabaster. I combine with some part of, of the wood. Oh, wow. Different with the, the material. Yeah. And here I, I broke into part. Was that purposely or no? It, yeah, it's <laughs> okay. a purpose. Yeah, you can see. Wow. You can see here. Yeah. The That's form. Gorgeous. How do you carve stone? It's, it's easy. It's easy. It's something, some technique. Okay. Believe me, I prefer working in stone than wood. Okay. Is it easier? Or oh, I prefer in wood than stone. Yes, I was part of the Manitoba Institute of Sculpture. Oh. Long time ago, almost 20 years. Okay. When I moved to Montreal too. Okay. Uh, the stone sometimes we bring from Utah. Okay. Alabaster, marble, and everything. Soft stone we can find here. Right, right. Uh, Kind of how it goes. So, is there a favorite stone that you like to carve? No, no, yeah, no. just kidding. It's a little bit any, of everything. Any, any material. <laughs> yeah. When I give you some workshop for jewelry, oh. because uh, Immigrant Center, I teach the people how they make jewelry and those kind of stuff. Okay. But for me, any jewelry is big sculpture and metal, and my my grow up. <laughs> That's beautiful. Now, do you take a file? Like, what kind of tools do you need to carve stone? Oh, right now, you you had a foreman. You had the electric tool for, for working. Oh, okay. Hydraulic, a big. But in, in this case, I prefer files okay. for filling the material and everything. But you have bits, details. different bits you can work in. It's easy. It's just something. Wow. For me, maybe it's easy because I love that. That's part of my life. Right. But when you have some technique, you can do it anything you want. How do you know when you're carving a piece that you're done? Because for me, I'm a nitpicky person, right? So I feel like this edge isn't right or this edge. How do you know as an artist that this is done, this is perfect, and I am happy? The material talked to me and said, Jorge, is enough. I am fed up. Okay, I'm sorry. Like bye, bye, honey. <laughs> <laughs> bye, bye, honey. Like a marriage. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just don't talk to me yeah. or the material. That's enough. Okay. And the next week I saw they need no, don't touch. Yeah. Do it and the other one. That's yeah, because uh, sometimes uh, can I see this one and say, oh, I prefer make that there here. And say, no, leave it. Yeah. Start a new one. Oh, that's great. That's just how I got. That's great advice in, in general. Now, this fascinates me. This is your your drawings. Yes, it is. I feel like I've seen this in a museum in Paris. Like this is so beautiful and unique. Now, there has to be a story about this. I think the drawing is more, more representative to me. First of all, I think at the beginning of all my life, big one, because the feet or the foot, feet, foot, Singular or plural, yeah. uh, represent to me those parts. And almost in my drawing, you can see all my drawings, they have some kind of representation because it's the root, the root. All my drawing is as a tree. Okay. You can see. Oh, I totally see that. They, they have branches, leaves. And the feet, is that about being grounded? That one is the culture. Oh. The ethnic group. Okay. The belief, the values, is how we, we grow up. That's how you grow At the beginning, tree. my yeah. philosophy is in three components, philosophic, sociologic, and psychologic. That's right. That one is we grow up our values. Yeah. 
Wow, that is so beautiful. Now, what as we're going up the tree? Yes, they come in with different difficulty in the life as a family, as individual. We grow up with difficulty. But I will tell you for first time, my drawing is in the empty space. Really? You see the feet, but this in the empty space. You see the face, but this, you feel in, see bodies, uh, different kind, but this in the empty space. I believe, I, I believe all human beings looking for something. That no matter material or that no matter spirit, but, and that one is empty. Some wow. people, they say gold, but we have empty. Yeah. We're looking for something, and you have that one, you need that one. It's how you play with your mind. Yeah. And that one, uh, this, this one is one part of the, the transformation, I do it. There are some values, I don't know why, my composition is like cross. When, when I start to thinking and say, that, wow, it's beautiful. All what, the, all yeah. the, I love the symbolic. Yeah. Sometimes I do so many symbols, right. uh, esoteric or different kind, but I put it all together. Now, did you start off drawing like this, or was it one of those things that it just came out of you as you started drawing? Yeah, 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 it's coming. A few lines, I start to do it. Yeah. And it's, that is so beautiful. Absolutely. Yeah, it has so, so, so many. Not a book like this. I have so many. Yeah, there's so there's hundreds yeah. upon hundreds of sketches in here. Yeah, you had different guy. I had with, with the Leo. I don't want to damage it. There we go. No, if you damage, you will pay that. I prefer damage. <laughs> It is so beautiful what your, your artwork is. And you can just feel the emotions, too, in yeah, your, your strokes. When I do it that one, I feel in free. Now, you also are a painter in your spare time. <laughs> Out of all the amazing no, work no. you do, there is, is this, this one. This is one part. It's my, my last part. I, when I'm working, I'm working in series. Okay. Maybe right. 20, 20 painting, 40. But in series, I call family. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. But the family has so many things, sociologic, psychologic, and philosophic. Right. One family has different values here, but how we can put it all together? That's, I do it. I never do it. This painting is a space. No, never I put a name right. in one, just only the series. That's beautiful. Now, is it always acrylic, or what do you paint in? That one is acrylic. I, pay, I paint in oil. Yeah. Yeah, in, in, in different mediums. Okay, in canvas and... In canvas, yes. Yeah. Beautiful. O, o, almost the acrylic, I do it in canvas. Now, you know what I've been looking forward to? I keep telling him this. I can't wait to open my kit. So can we now try some painting together? Okay, sure. I'm very happy to do that. Okay, grab right. your kit. Let's go. Let's go. So Jorge, before we start our kits, you're going to show us some other techniques that we can also do. Oh, sure. We have uh, different options for the background, blue, green. In this case, maybe we can use black. Oh, okay. That's fine for you? Yeah, I love okay, black. Okay, okay. Yes, yeah, very simple technique. Look. Okay, so a blob of paint. And now with this small tools, you yeah. can do it with brush, with knife, oh, okay. but I prefer this knife. one, because I remember when I was a kid, yeah. <laughs> for doing my pixel, look, enjoy the, the background, yeah. it's something simple, it's, but you can do it more in your spirit, in your soul. Now, do you recommend playing some, some beautiful Latino music, or... Is there any El Salvador oh, singers that we should Google? In El Salvador, all the time we're working with the music, the people dancing. Now you said there was almost a party every weekend. Look, right now, Ooh. you have your background. You okay. can use a blue, red. Doesn't no matter. We will clean if you wish, but it's no big deal. Now, 
We will choose two color for the beginning green. So you got your background and now we're working on, oh, a couple dots. But they didn't come in, look. They're tired. Yeah, look. Yeah, it's been a long you week. can put it, put it a, a, a dot. Yeah. We can do it with limes. When you experimental, you will feel it more. Look at, I use it a little bit. You can put it more like here. Okay. We will do it in the next one. Sounds good. And now we will take a, the blue. Look. Wow. It's beautiful. Too much. <laughs> Is nothing wrong here. Look. Okay. I will do it with two color, and now for me, this one is the secret. Beads. You put it like this, around there, and just oh. only push, 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 push. Look. Oh, they wow. Coming. It's all forming together. Look. You can play whenever you want. Look. Like this. That is gorgeous. And it seems very relaxing too. That's it, the, exactly the point. It's relaxing, look. Yeah. How flow everything there. And it doesn't matter the direction the beads go, nothing, it's no, kind of what you feel no, like. No, 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 how are you feeling? Look at the beauty oh, that's there. that's gorgeous. You can it's find, like and now we did when you can take out, but I prefer doing something funny, look. Oh, like a zigzag line. You can do it anything. The important look, what you saying? You are used with a knife. You don't have to own a um, multi-million dollar craft No, it's kits. very you simple. You can just have simple things like yeah. that. And now, we will clean this part for use it. And use it again. And you can use it again. Perfect. That one, you can use it with two, four colors, six, seven. It's how you're feeling. Yeah. Yeah, it's a simple technique. Look, now you can play in different direction. Just go with how you feel, right? That one is exactly. It's how the material go with your soul. Oh, that's beautiful. You don't know how to be big artist or something like that. You can use this part. Look, put it. Something just simple. Dots. Now what are you going to use? Oh, back to the chain. Okay. Yeah, you, you can do as it. As long as it's not like apparent chain. jewelry, Look. something you have around the house. <laughs> Look. Oh, that's beautiful. How chain. Yeah. The red, passion, yeah. life, love. And that one is the beauty, I love it. I want to fill in the material. Look this example. That's you have gorgeous. this one. We will put it here. Okay. And now we will try to to do it with different background. Okay. So we're still not touching our kit yet. We're still looking at the different examples, right? Right. Yes. Awesome. Yeah. I will do it. And the another example and. Um, Awesome. Maybe okay, can't we wait. will do it together. Okay. Together for feeling. Uh, I will use it. Give me a color. Give me. I like the red. I like the passion, the love that you were talking oh, about. Oh, wow. I like that. I'm a love girl. Oh, look at this. Now oh. it's not coming out. There's so much love. <laughs> this one, they need me Zumba. Oh. That one you have to enjoy. Yeah. It's nothing. Now, do you listen to music when you paint? Oh, yes, yeah. uh, all the time. Salsa, merengue, bachata, oh. and some Thai classic, but some Thai. Oh, okay, depending on your mood. You know, we will try to do it something a little different. 
In this case, we will put it Spreading it all around. Oh, but you're not, are you doing the whole thing? Oh, you want to do it with oh, the no, color? Oh, no, no, you tell me. This no, is, no, this is no. interesting. You are my boss. Oh, this well, one <laughs> we have to enchair. It's not every day I'm the boss. Yes, um, no, this one is for enchair. It's nothing about I want to do this this way. Right. That's how we can feel it. Maybe we'll put it to color. And do you have a favorite color that you'd like to paint with? In my painting, in my artwork, yes. Yes? Yeah. I had uh, different colors, uh, but almost is in red. Um, the pen is different technique. For example, now you can see oh, how the color, they come in. The theoretical, in color they say red and blue, they may purple, but sometimes it's more experimental. So what inspires you to paint? It's my life. Yeah. Painting, carving, that's a part of me. Mm -hmm. I can do, look at this. That's Simple. beautiful. We're gonna add some green drops. And now we will have the troll. The troll? Is that what you call the green paint? Oh. This one you can do it in dot limes, okay. anything you feeling. Yeah. The most important is how you feeling. So you've had a stressful day, it might be dots. And yes. then if you've had a peaceful lime. day, it's the, or maybe it's by your third painting, limes. Yes, or oh, maybe you had a stroke. Yes, bring out the love. You have to put it there. <laughs> but just be happy. Mm -hmm. You... and then you just move the paint. Wow. Yeah. Oh, that's beautiful. All that from beads. Yeah, it's something simple. Yeah. Oh, that's gorgeous. That is beautiful. Yeah, it's something simple. Everybody can do it. Yeah, that's great. Simple technique, simple relaxing, talking. Talk it with your son, your daughter, everybody play. If you don't know how to do you have ball. You can do it in ball. You can do it in anything, not in your face, I don't know. But. <laughs> okay, this is a small composition. And this one is a square, but you can do it with a... The rectangles rectangle. or circles. Yeah, you can put it the beans. Uh, do you always use some type of almost a wood, or do, would you do more on the, the canvas? Uh, you can do it in canvas too. In okay. big one, big yeah. one, you use it big chains. Beautiful. Yeah, that, that one is uh, some technique in acrylic. Yeah. And that one is, uh, for example, I use it in big painting, the technique for that one. Okay. Yeah, it's, yeah. How are you feeling? How are you feeling? I love that. That's the best advice for life. Yeah. Should we get started on our kits? I'm just so excited. I'm sorry. Okay, <laughs> okay. We will start. Okay, Tanya. And now it's your time. I was my time. I I've been waiting for this I all want day. to see your energy. Okay. I will do it on the other one more. Oh, I would love that. Yes. Okay, Choose so your have... color. Have our colors. Oh, but it came with a chain. That's good. I was I was secretly hoping that so I didn't have to. No, steal everything, around the everything house. is there completely. Wonderful. You have colors. Mm, so we choose our background color. Okay, you choose your background. Okay. Ah, now it's blue. The sky. I, I do. I love a good the sky. Sea. You know what? Too wow. ocean. Right? The ocean. Love the ocean. Okay. Yeah. So glad I live in Winnipeg. So, yeah. Really? There's no ocean. <laughs> <laughs> that one can I see. So you just spread it along the back, okay. I 
And the other is when you're working in this part, you can put it some pin here, oh, a on small the sides. pin. Oh, okay. For, for a stand up or some wood. Or, but I love working like that because can I see in my board lines too. It's definitely a good tip. So how many paintings do you think you've painted in your lifetime? Maybe it's more easy if you are doing like that, flat. Okay, more easy, got it. Yeah. Look at this, this part, look. Okay. Yeah. Flat. Slow and steady. Mm. Okay, so... Now you will give you the workshop for me. <laughs> you are great. Now I can teach after this. That's good to know. Yes, for Extra sure. Career. That one is the idea. Extra and chair. Love this color. It's nice color. Yeah. But in this part, put it like this. Look, will be more easy. Okay. I need more paint. I think you don't know want to. Or maybe I don't. Look, no, look at my hands. Look, eh? I know, we're yeah. go you're gonna get messy. <laughs> yes, <laughs> Embrace that thing. the messiness. <laughs> no, so, when you have practice here, because I would like to feel in, it's nothing uh, very important you have to. So do we have to make our whole background one color or can we just go with what we feel like? You go when you're feeling. Okay. That, that, that's it, no big, big deal. I can't wait to do this chain move. Very excited about that. Yeah, no, look at this, for example, right now, I do it in this part. I'm gonna do some dots and a line. Dots, lines. So how many paintings do you think you've done in your lifetime? Ah. In your 29 years, Jorge, how long, how many paintings do you think you've done? It's impossible to tell you. Do you have a set goal that you like to do every year or is it just what you feel? Ah. Okay, I drawing, I painting, I carving every day. That's every amazing. day. Yeah. A smaller one. Big one. So right now, the, with the COVID, for me, it's a good opportunity because it's good and it's bad because I don't know how more material. Right. I don't know where can I buy. Right. But I have papers. I know how to excuse. Yeah. I draw. In. That's great. It keeps you busy. Not yes, it keep, keep you busy in that part. So we just go around whatever colors. Look at this. Oh, that's beautiful. The neat thing I think we need to keep in mind, at least I'm reminding look, myself. Look at this part. Oh, wow. I think you are doing it at home, for sure. I think and you are doing it. Is gonna look Every, everyone, you have the kit over there, right? Yep. And now look. Ooh, look at this. That's gorgeous. What do, what do you think? Did I do okay? Everything is okay. <laughs> you made that. I love this. This is beautiful. Yeah, it's... What a great gift for people, too, right? So easy to do, but comes from the heart. You can put a nice message. Thank you, Jorge, for being amazing. It is. Right? Things like that. You can put it here. Oh, that's beautiful. If I do say so myself. My home. Oh. I love you. Yeah. Where is honey and home? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. That's a simple. A simple but beautiful way to express your emotions. Yeah, it yeah. is. When you explore, I, I would like to explore different techniques in acrylic with uh, resin and those kind of things for... I don't know, I say teach. I say in chair. I love that. Because I learn from you. That one is very different because it's your soul, it's not mine. Right. I learn. Well, thank you for sharing your gifts with us today. Yeah, you thank you for inviting me. I appreciate that everything you are doing. Our pleasure. Thank you. Thank you.
So thank you so much for joining us today at the Folklorama at Home, the virtual experience. Stay tuned to our social media channels at Folklorama or on our website at folklorama.ca to learn more. Thanks for joining us today.